Hello! Today I have for you a very special pelican from my collection. It is a vintage pelican 140, all in dark green. The little gruner, as I call it. So this is um, made in 1954. It is a medium small pen and has a pleasant round shape specific of the 1950s, like a torpedo shape. In uh, comparison, I have here a Mont Blanc 146 from uh, 1952. It's uh, quite similar in shape, the torpedo shape. And um, I have uh, older pens in the Pelican lineup. The Pelican 100 Black, the Pelican 100N, and some uh, newer fountain pens. I will start with um, Pelican. M150s, uh, 150 from uh, 1997, and the Pelican M800. Also, I have a Lamy 2000 and a vintage uh, Scheffler balance from the uh, 30s. So I hope you can uh, see them. As a comparison, so the M800 is quite uh, big. You can see. And I will also do a small um, Waiting of this pen, so this is uh, momentarily without ink in it, and it has 14 grams. I will start my review by showcasing these uh, beautiful gold uh, trims. As you can see, we have the famous Pelican Beak, gold-plated beak. On the cap, on the ring, it says uh, Germany. And Pelican 140. The domed uh, top of the cap. It has uh, the beautiful imprint, the Pelican logo. It is imprinted on the plastic. Very, very beautiful uh, cigar or torpedo shaped uh, design. This particular fountain pen has this beautiful ink, uh, green ink uh, window which is uh, quite practical. You can see the transparency on uh, it. Of course, it's a piston fitting uh, mechanism, so it uh, unscrews and we can see the plastic cork. Now, when we pull uh, the ink, this uh, ink window will um, show the ink level. The grip it is, I hope you see, it's not uh, black, but it's also um, a dark green. It ends with uh, this concave shape, so you can hold it quite uh, securely. It has uh, this um, beautiful nib, and I hope you can see the details. It's a 14 carat 585 gold nib. And I love the fact that Pelican writes uh, the size of the nib. It's, um, I don't know if you can see it, but it uh, ends with an F, the size of the nib. 
It has this uh, beautiful ebonite feed in uh, this interesting shape. And uh, why do I love so much pelicans? Because you can unscrew this part quite easily and you can reach the barrel and you can do the cleaning of the barrel so it uh, fits right back in and it's um, ready for writing this is um, like I told you before a lightweight uh, fountain pen is very comfortable to use and uh, you will see in the writing sample that uh, this uh, vintage nib has uh, a small flex an interesting flex mm, a beautiful beautiful classic uh, german piston filler from the 50s I highly recommend this uh, fountain pen if you don't have it in your collection. I hope you've enjoyed my small review and uh, I wish you a nice day. As always for my um, writing uh, sample, I've used this uh, I use this uh, pelican Queen King. So, the writing sample, we have a pelican, one hundred and forty in green, or like I said, my little gruner. from 1954 this has a 14 carat 585 gold nib it's an f nib some line variation And I see, I see if I could make some flexi move. So, um, thank you for watching this uh, mall review. If you enjoyed it, please uh, subscribe and uh, have a nice day.